I've probably been to my funniest shoot so far. Story, the town I'm from and it's pretty much built around a factory and a sawmill so a friend of mine used to work at the sawmill it's still active but they got some old like magazines that left that they used to store stuff so we actually went there at night we didn't do any illegal we actually called someone and asked like do you think it's okay if we go and take some photos there and yeah, he thought it was fine, so we did. We actually went there. We didn't like jump any fences. It's just walking in there. It's a huge area. So it was super fun, super excited to do it because the guy I was there with, he used to work there. He knew a lot of stuff like stories and like what ha what had happened there, all that kind of stuff. And you know, Shaq, like he, he's been there before photographing with friends. We should go there, we should go there. Uh, this place is awesome when there's a little bit of sunlight this spot right here So we're definitely gonna go back there sometime When the Sun is still up, but yeah, he showed me around a lot there and we snapped a couple of pictures most of them ended up super cool this one for example uh, we found this stool chair like it looks like nowhere. It was like a ramp going up there and there were fans that were drying off the, the logs that had been cut. So we took the we took this picture, I told him like, you sit there. It was a, a lamp that was lighting up just like a circle on the floor. He was sitting there like looking like he was going in on a boxing match or something. Uh, and I, always, I snapped this one when he was walking down the hallway. I think it just looked cool. And uh, we also like we went inside a little bit, but most of the time we we're outside. We also took another picture with this chair, uh, him sitting in. Like he like, oh yeah, let's do like a cowboy, cowboy style. Like when you turn the chair around, so he was sitting there, he's looking to the side. Uh, I brought my loom cube, which I thought like, okay, let's see if we can find. Uh, plastic pipe or something that we can put the loom cube in and make like a lightsaber of it and do some cool light painting didn't find anything but uh, this one like you could walk between those huge like piles of planks it was very dark there so I put my loom cube on one of the planks so I could light him up a little bit uh, I think it's a cool picture like he's pretty much coming out of the darkness there. So the sawmill is located like on the other side of a, say a river from the like the factory that we have here in town. So when we walked around and I found the spot, it was like open, between, it was open between the trees. So, so I put my camera down, snapped like a landscape picture of the factory, which I think ended up pretty cool. I need to have like a, a shutter speed that could mad, like get some light in. So the the clouds coming out of the chimneys of the factory actually look a little bit misty, more like smooth because of that. But yeah, it's still a cool picture. As I said, I took my loom cube with me. Uh, I was really fun. Didn't find the plastic pipe, but we actually got a couple of pictures that, like a couple of, we got I actually got one picture that I thought like this is amazing so we walked around a lot there and he showed me in one of the magazine it was standing it was in Jaguar standing there apparently the owner is like a drunk so he can't drive it yeah like it, t it's, it was tickets on it like they've been paid uh, you could see on it, it was like all dusty like I don't know what year it was from, but it was old. But when you open it up, it looks like pretty much brand new. Like, hasn't been used at all. 
saw the guy was there with actually I tried to reach out to the, the guy that owns it and I wanted to buy it off him. But every time when he doesn't answer when he or when he answers, he you just hear his voice, he hears a younger guy younger guy talking to him. So he hangs up the phone. So we had a lot of fun there walking around. He was telling me stories and hopefully we can go back there when there's still sun, like the sun is still up. We had a little bit of day, like sunlight when we just got there, but it was still very dark around the area. Yeah, as I said, I had my drink cube with me, but we couldn't find a plastic pipe or I don't know what to call it, but we wouldn't do some light painting. And it's way easier if you got something that's a little bit longer, like the light is like, the light is long, like a, like a pipe, like a lightsaber. You want a lightsaber, it looks really cool. Couldn't find anything that could make it for us. So we just did something, I just walked behind him, long shutter speed, I think it was like five seconds, I just spinned it. After a little bit of work in photo, not even in Photoshop, a little bit after a little bit of work in Lightroom, I actually got this picture up, which I'm really happy about. The only downside with this is I didn't really get to focus. I saw when I got home, I didn't really get to focus on his face. Yeah, other than that, I think pictures are really cool. I used a gradient filter on each side and just crank the temp, like the color levels up. So one side is more blue, one side is more orange, which makes it look like neon lights going behind him. This one going goes on my Instagram for sure. Okay, I don't really got anything more for this video. Hopefully we can go back there when this, yeah, when the light is better. He had a friend that's very interested in photographing as well. So we we'll probably bring him, him next time. The guy I was there with is interested, but he doesn't have a camera yet. He, he doesn't know what level he wants to put it on, but he likes photographing with his phone, which mo like for now, like today's phones are pretty much better than the camera I have at the moment, but you can do a lot with your phone. Uh, yep, that's it for this video. Uh, I hope you like it. If you do, leave a thumbs up, uh, consider subscribing and ring the bell to get notified whenever I'm uploading. Also, if you go to the link down below, I have a printler uh, gallery where you can order pictures and a frame. Uh, you can go there and look at my picture if, if there's nothing you like there. You can look at other photographer, photographers and like art designer. But yep, that's everything. I uh, hope to see you in the next video. Peace out. <laughs>